Iraq is a country at war with Islamic State and many of our diggers marked Anzac Day there in the desert. Hundreds of Australian and New Zealand troops are there on one of our biggest shared missions since Gallipoli, on active service in a region under threat. Even in such a harsh country, there are moments of beauty. And today in Camp Taji, also the sounds of remembrance. This is the first Anzac Day service in the Iraqi base. We do remember those who died. There are 300 Australians, 100 Kiwis and a few curious Americans. I'm very honoured to be here. The piper's great-grandfather played the bagpipes at Gallipoli. It may find a bad pipe, so it's, sort of, you know, it's always a bigger thing for the family than you know, actually marching around with a rifle. They also played cricket on the famous peninsula. The Taji pitch is not much better. But the troops are happy to be here, especially today. Just thankful for those that served before us. Um, we're the reason. If it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be here uh, on this mission. Although it's the Middle East, the dawn service feels so familiar. But there's no public holiday here. These soldiers will have to put in a full day's work, many of them wearing battle armour and carrying loaded weapons. But first, the traditional gunfire breakfast, though no rum is allowed. <laughs> in Camp Taji, Baghdad, Sean Berry, 7 News.